Python has standard libraries which we can use in our programs by importing them. We do not have to install those standard libraries separately as they come along with the Python. So once we install Python on our machine, we already have all these standard libraries available for us. So we can start directly importing them and use them. But there might be a situation where you need some functionality which is not provided by the standard libraries but developed by some other developer or a company and available as a third party library. And if you want to use that in your program, you will need to download it, install it and then only you can import it in your program and start using it. So to do that, we use pip command. Pip is a Python package manager which allows us to install the package that we are interested in to install it. So the command for it is pip install and the name of the package or pip3 install and the name of the package. Depending on your machine as well as the version of the Python you have, you might have pip or pip3. This command will actually look for the package name and search of whether the package is available locally on the machine or not. If it is already installed, it will just ignore it and just give a message that the package is already installed. If the package is not installed, it will look for the package in its own repositories, download that package and start the installation. Once the installation has started, it will also look for any kind of a dependencies that the package is having. If there are any other dependencies which are not available on your machine, it will download those dependencies as well and install them. So let's see an example of this. To use that, we need to first confirm that we have pip installed on your machine. So for that, we can say pip hyphen hyphen version. If it gives an error that the command pip not found, that means we do not have pip installed on a machine. We have to install it. PIP is a Python 3 module. So to install that we, on a Linux machine, we can use apt-get command. So, let, so let's install it, sudo apt-get install python3 hyphen pip. Since it's a Python 3 module, we have to specify the version. Press enter. This will start installing the pip on our machine. So here we are done with the installation of the pip. 